But I got this theory I've come up with after a lifetime of watching news coverage or tornadoes. I believe there's a conspiracy to make those of us who live in tornado country to look ignorant on TV. <laughs> Don't you find it odd that after thousands of tornadoes, thousands of destroyed homes over the years, they never can interview anybody that's been to the dentist? <laughs> you have never seen on the evening news a tornado victim from a trailer park in a three-piece suit, <laughs> a monogram shirt, going, yes, this was rather devastating. <laughs> a tree fell on the Lexus. <laughs> and there's quite a bit of rubble in our hot tub. <laughs> I believe with all my heart that when a tornado hits, the news director at the local TV station, he tells his reporter, get out to the trailer park and interview a dumbass. <laughs> and try to find one who's married to a fat woman. <laughs> and hey, listen, have you noticed that, the, that everything's, complete, everything's destroyed except for the produce sign? <laughs> and the camera zooms in on that. Tomatoes for sale, <laughs> spelled with an R. <laughs> 45 cents a pound or two pounds for a dollar. <laughs> now the whole world knows we can't spell and hell we can't add either. <laughs> and here's the couple they interview. The husband, the head of the household, He's always real sickly, anemic looking. Real frail, like 112 pounds. 108 without the belt buckle. <laughs> Wearing a John Deere cap. Got that out of the way. He's got a tattoo on a wooden arm. <laughs> so he saw a sign at the mall, tattoo it while you wait. He said, hell, I ain't gotta wait. <laughs> got a tire gauge in his pocket. That's in case the trailer don't seem level. And he's wearing a key ring with two pounds of keys. <laughs> what the hell is that all about? There's only three doors in this man's life. <laughs> Truck, trailer, and tool shed. <laughs> now there says next to his wife. His wife, God bless her, weighs 400. <laughs> 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 Wearing those tight, tight <laughs> polyester pants. <laughs> you know, little irrigation ditches in that house. <laughs> why, why, why do they wear that? <laughs> Don't they know how that looks? <laughs> I know they're fat, but hell, they're not blind. How can a 400 pound woman put on tight polyester pants, then look in a mirror and go, all right. <laughs> and she's always wearing, <laughs> I just thought of this, I'm gonna throw it in. <laughs> <laughs> She's always wearing flip-flops. 
because she thinks her feet are her best feature. <laughs> and sadly, she's right about that. <laughs> ah. And she's always, always wearing a beeper. Let me tell you all about fat people and beepers. They should wear the old kind of beeper, the one that made a noise. They got these modern high tech ones now, they don't make a noise, they simply vibrate. Well, trust me on this. If you weigh 400 pounds, you're missing calls. 